Hi guys, Cindy here. It's nail day. Okay, so here's my nails from last week and a quick update. Those uh, nails I used last week did not work really good as press on because they were too sculpted. You know, you, they worked okay with poly gel or um, gel, but as you know, I'm not doing that anymore. So here's my poor little injured hands. There, I think I've got pretty much most of the old gel off. There's uh, these one two fingers are in the worst shape, the thumb and the pointer. And um, but anyway, they're just gonna have to be there. Um, the ones I wore last week, they were off completely by Thursday, maybe it was Wednesday. Uh, one of the nails just snapped when I hit something. I guess it didn't have as much um, stuff without polyula stuff. And so I cut it down and I cut all the others down. And then I ended up just pulling those dudes off. They didn't stick that good anyway because they were so curved. And uh, I put on some of those little stickers that I got from Amazon, which they're okay in a pinch. They're not as good as Color Street, but a whole lot cheaper. You know, you're talking about a dollar per package versus $14 per package. Anyway, so I don't know if you can see in the background, I got some new polish in. This came from Walmart.com. Uh, um, it came in like in a bundle with a whole bunch of colors and today was a big decision what color we was going to use. Um, it's supposed to be kind of cool next week but I'm still not ready for fall. I would like to wait till after Labor Day and I'm still wearing summer clothes and so I'm going to try not to buy anything this year. I'm just going to shop out of my closet. I think Caesar do that pretty good. So, and I've already started my nails. I got a little, um, I painted them. Let's see. I painted them. That's all I've done. And I did get some new nails that we're going to try. Oh, excuse me. These are E. See basket, you know, a lot of people said they liked them, it got good reviews. These are just plastic, they're not um, gel. But um, one thing I like about them, to me they seem kind of proportional. Like the pinky is shorter than the thumb. Like the pre's and stuff, they're all the same length. And that, that's how I injured my pinky. Uh, it's just, you can't take a longer nail for that little teeny tiny nail. So, um, anyway, these, I got these off Amazon. I can't remember what they were, but $9, $10, something like that. And I've got some more tips coming in. After my nails get healthier, we can try that out. Some different, some edge tips. I'm going to try to cut the, the bottom off of them and to make them full cover, but we'll see. And what else did I get in? Um, you know, you already saw these little stands I got in. And, um, these little tips, this is what we're going to use instead of super glue. Potentially, I might uh, put it on my nail and put that super glue on top of it because in the reviews on Amazon, someone said that they did that. But we don't know. We might not. We'll just see. Um, oh, the glue. Glue. If we use any glue, we've got this. Uh, this is some old new glue from that. Was it LA Colors? I'm chunking that. It's probably all out anyway. So we're just going to chunk it. So, one thing I need to do is, I noticed I didn't get the little rough edges off the tip of these, so I need to do that real quick. Oh, I'm going to move this down so y'all can see. There you go. I'm just trying to get the tip off because I'm kind of worried with what we're going to do. They're not going to be near sturdy as uh, just super glue, but you know, I'm trying to save my nails from being so much abuse. And I did see some of these little stickers at walmart.com that I'd had mine ordered for a while, so I didn't get them. I might get some more there if it turns out I like these and these don't damage my nail. Because the super glue does kind of leave a little layer on your nail, and potentially you could pull off that top layer, so you don't want that. I should have probably done this first. I did not edge the inside or anything like that, so we'll just kind of see how it goes. Okay, so now what I want to do is I've got to get out my, uh, I want to use some foil. I used it in a while. So I need my one, two, three, 
for Edel Couture. Shiny, that's not it. I don't like no dipped in pretty gel. I mean, I'm not mad at dipped in pretty gel. I think it probably any gel would have done that today, but that's just the last thing that I used. I'm having trouble finding my foil glue. It might be in my box. Hold on just one second. Here's my Enel Couture box that I keep some stuff in. And let's see how this works. I still haven't placed another order with them. I'm not mad at them or anything. I just don't need anything. So there's no reason to. Oh, hold on a second. So let's give this a try. So I pulled out some foils that I kind of like. I think I'm kind of liking this uh, lace for some nails and then some flowers for some nails. They, this might go. So, these is the two that I've picked out. And so I'm gonna do a little on each hand, maybe, you know. Uh, these are pretty, I've used those before, but we're not gonna do that today. And these folds I just got off Wish. I did order me some more nail stuff from Wish, but I didn't come in. It'll be forever. So, where's my, uh, this is my film glue. So, let's see. I'm going to push this up closer. Closer. I'm so used to doing it on my hand where it's right next to me. So... Yeah, I'm trying to keep um, all those chemicals off my fingers. My hands are doing a lot better, and I want to stay that way. And probably my fingernails are growing out about a half an inch. So in another month, there'll be another half an inch. And this is just regular nail polish that I've got on here. It is not gel polish. So we're going to see how this works. I've never... I have bought some Wish nail glue before and ended up throwing it away. Probably I got too impatient because you have to put it on and wait and I got too impatient. I like the kind that you just stick under the lamp for a minute. And so here's me a lamp. Let's do these all at once. Let's see. Put that under there until it goes off. That's 30 seconds. We're going to do 30 seconds more when it's done. This might work better. Make sure they're all getting there. Y'all having a good week? I hope so. And hopefully when I get done, I'll show you my eyelashes again. Of course, these are the same ones I wore last week. They're blueberry. I didn't wear them to work. Although, I wore a bunch of big fluffy ones. My husband says he doesn't like the big fluffy ones. And then Friday, I just sort of wore some that, you know, might be considered natural. They're, I think the brand was Appeal, and they came in the... Um, uh, lashy box and <laughs> I just felt naked because I'd worn those big fluffy ones. Okay, so let's get going. So let's take on the pinkies. Let's just do um do let's see which side is which. Let's do this lace. See how that works out for us. Oh, and these are little magnetic holders. I got them off of Amazon, and they have some little putty that went with them. I cut mine in real little pieces because um, one I wanted to last. 
the main reason. And then two, some of these little nails. I hope I'm doing the right side. It's hard to tell. Well, some of it came off. Let's try some more. Okay. Not much. I don't think this is any easier to do than to do it on your finger. So this pinky is not going to be that whippy, but oh well, live and learn. Well, we can't use polish remover and get it off because we got regular nail polish underneath it. So it's just going to have to be bad. It's just all there is to it. So let's try the other pinky. Maybe I'll do a better job on this one. That one's a little bit better. Mm, it's not perfect, but oh well. So, then the fourth finger we're going to use. Um, maybe some these flowers. This one's easier to see because it's got kind of a white back. It's been a while since I've done foils. Anyway, it's okay. There's where that one looks like. I don't know if you can see it good. Let's try this now, the fourth finger on this hand. Some people have little tools, and I think I've got a little tool ordered from Wish. Uh-oh. Okay, so that's what that one looks like. Sideways. Ugh, I'm going to have to dig the little putty off of those. Let's do some more lace. This will be a bigger nail. Maybe that'll work out better. Uh oh. I've seen some people like use double uh, back tape on these. That might be good. If when I run out of pay. One fell off. It's falling off. I guess maybe I shouldn't be trying to do these. 
take them off. I'm for sure going to have to um, do a top coat. I can dig the putty out, that's what I mean. Just saying. Okay. So they make it look a lot easier, some of these people that's doing these. You gotta really scrub it on. You can't just lay it on. If these stay on good, that would be great. Because you know we're not having to get our hands under the lamp and stuff like that. Ooh, look what I done. Got that on some of the other nails. Well, then it looks like we're just going to do full on the rest of them. I planned on doing the thumb uh, flower now. But I don't know now. We might still be able to. See, now if I'd have wanted it in those places, no way it would have stuck. Okay, that's okay. Okay. Well, since we've already got black on here, we're just going to do black, black lace. It's pretty. And what a lot of people would do with putting gems and stuff on there, which I'm not going to do. Um, I like them. I like it when other people do them. I'm just not real creative enough. Maybe another day. And I've still got all my stamping stuff. I'm going to still give stamping another try. Just not today. Oh, well, that didn't work out good. I wonder if I did the wrong side, if that's what the problem was. Yeah, that did better. I did have the wrong side. Ah, geez. Which side is which? We'll try this side. Uh -oh. Drop it again. Okay, so let's pull this off. Okay, that looks pretty. Now then, we're going to do a top coat. I have a gel top coat, so it'll dry. So, let's do that. One of these days, I'll go back to using the base coat, but probably not on my real nails. Probably just um, as part of the decoration, you know. I don't want to run my real nails again. So, so 
So let's paint these real quick. And we only had one flower nail. I planned on in two, but since I kind of goofed that one up, we didn't. That's okay. We'll get better. And this is my shiny from Email Couture. You don't have to worry about getting this on your skin or nothing. Let's paint the nail. I think I did get some on my fingers. I'm gonna go bump into it. Alrighty. Okay, let's see what's going on here. Okay, good. I'm afraid I would turn it off. I didn't. Okay, so let's put this under the lamp. And we're going to do it for a whole minute. That's all I'll do it twice. This is 30 seconds each. Pick that up a little bit. And then, while we're working on it, let's get these a little thicker about. I need the alcohol on my finger because I put on makeup just since I did it. Okay, one more time. Here's the sheet. So it's like 24 on here. And I can't remember if this is a our as a shiny get your color designed in the USA. Let's see what the back says. Says, what does this say? Warning. Well, I can't see well enough. It says design. Okay, so let's I got some alcohol here. So make sure my hands are good and clean. Did I tell you I did have two top coats of this? I ordered me some more that you know someone suggested I use something else, and and it's not in yet. So let's see how this works out. These do not have any instructions on them, so we're just gonna play it intuitive. Oh, one thing I need to see: are these sticky? No, these are not sticky, so it doesn't look like I need to do them. Although I can. Take it and do it just a little bit for good measure. Just for good measure. Okay, so here's our little task. Let's start with the pinky. And I don't have any fingernails. Put this on a pinky. Now, so someone said on the reviews that they put super glue on top of this too. And I have never done this at all. Okay. Let's just see how it works. I'm gonna I'm gonna try it without the super glue, and if they fall off and stuff, I'll go ahead and put super glue on, and I will let you know. Let me grab some tweezers or something. This is. I 
Alrighty. I'm back. I definitely don't like this putty. I mean, I just, stuff like that is kind of gross to me. So we won't be trying to reuse it, that's for sure. Maybe I'll try to get some double back tape or something to use instead. It came with the um, things. I did not buy it separate. So let's see how this works out. It seems kind of tight. I mean, not as tight as super glue. I may very well have to. We're going to wear them like this, and we're just going to see how long they last. And I'm going to let you know, okay? Let's do the other one, Pinky. Yep, we got this nasty thing in here again. Oh. Uh, I, I think I'm going to find some double. I do not like this. It may be the best thing we got, though. Maybe I'll get used to the gross factor. If you guys have an idea, a suggestion, what to use instead of this uh, tacky stuff, let me know. might help the nail stick a little better. Oh, we got to do another thing. So let's do another one here. Let's find another pinky. Here's one. So pull that off. Oh, well. I dropped it. Well, let's just pull another one off. Is the way it is. I dropped it and I can't see it. Oh, here's something on my finger. It's still on my finger. It's pretty sticky, so that's a good thing. Okay, I just wasted one. That's okay. That's okay. You have to get used to using them. Now then put it on your finger. It will probably it works best if you can get it over your whole finger. I don't think I did that. And then pull this little tab off. A little covering off. Let's see if we can get all this gross stuff off this. These girls that are selling the press on, I admire them getting all that stuff off. Okay. It's got a pretty good little stick. I mean, I don't know how it's going to work with washing your hair and stuff like that. Anyway, this one here. Uh. I got a little stain on it from something, probably that tacky stuff. Anyway, that's okay. We're just learning. So the next one will be try to measure. Let's just go ahead and pull this off and get that tacky stuff off first. Yes, I don't like this. And the other one. I was hoping it would stick on the little things and they could be reusable, but I guess not. Okay. Okay, so. Let's find another one. So that's a big one. Let's do this one right here. Get that one 
Ich glaube, war. Those little things on. My biggest complaint about this is that white tacky stuff, which that's going to be there whether I use super glue or not. Okay, let's pull another one. If these will stay on a few days, I think I'm going to like that because even if you have to put some more on in the middle of the week, it'd be okay. Or even if um, you put super glue on top of them, at least that would be one more layer between your real nail and any super glue or something. Oh, and these e-basket, I think they were medium, and I definitely got them off Amazon. I'm going to do a big one for this now. Okay. They look, these look like they're in all different kinds of sizes. So... Uh-oh, I forgot to get that tacky stuff off. Okay. Let's take that tacky stuff off while we're at it. It wants to stick to those nails, that's for sure. My guess would be we need to keep our hands out of water for a little bit. Let's find another one. And next week, hopefully I'll get to do my nails. I do have a hair appointment. So, but they got closed down because of the pathogen. So, I don't know if it's still there or not. We'll just have to see. Now, let's take these sticky things off. Time something to fit. Here's one. Come on now. This one's not very big. I hope I'll be big enough. Oh well. And boy, and once you get it on, it's on. So if you stick it on crooked, too bad. So sad. Which I did. But that's okay. We'll, you know, we might redo these tomorrow. Or if they look like they're snapping off. So this one didn't do the whole cover, the whole nail. I picked one that was kind of small, plus I got it crooked. I didn't mean to pick a small one. It was just smaller than my nail. It's just the way it turned out. So here's one that came off. Dog on it. So they do not cover your whole nail. Especially if you got kind of long nails. But these little stickies had good reviews.
So that's the last one. Now we're going to call it a day. And then I got to go to Walmart, pick up my groceries, come back home, clean up this mess. I think I am liking these little sticky things, even if they don't hold that good. Um, you could be another layer. And then still use the super glue. And I, like I said, I don't know if I said it or not. I saw some on Walmart. So here these are. These little easy basket nails <laughs> with our little, um, can we find those things? With our stickers, uh, tab stickers, no super glue, and some of this, uh, I think this is the color I used. But they're all very pretty colors. I did use the green earlier, but they kind of bubbled. I think it's just the way I did them on my nails. Probably if I do them on these fake nails, they'll look prettier. So I got to get going. And y'all have a great day. Oh, I was going to show you these eyelashes again. I'm just loving these. I didn't wear them to work or anything. But um, I decided to wear them today. And so I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.